Today, Jackson Central Mary celebrated its second homecoming since reopening. We wanted to go big. We wanted to have like a mini HBCU uh, homecoming, um, starting off with the parades, um, then have a tailgate celebration after, everything outside. So that's, that was a vision that we had this year to celebrate our football team in our first year as being varsity football. Students helped organize the parade and every class created a float. We had our student council meeting and I told them, I gave them the expectations that I had for our vision for homecoming and they took the lead. The two feeder schools for Jackson Central Mary, Arlington and Alexander, brought their students to the parade. Alumni from across the years joined in on the celebration. To come back and see our kids and to see the rebirth of JCM, this is what it's all about. Giving our kids the opportunity to show who they are and to get an opportunity to express themselves and uh, to be part of it is just great. We want to instill in these classes now that, you know, you can do anything. You know, you don't have to follow the leader. You are the, you are the leader. So incredibly excited to be out here for the parade this morning, um, just to be able to see the creativity of each of the classes, um, to also be able to just take part in a community event. Uh, we had kids out here from elementary schools, and it just really, you know, their faces were lighting up. Alumni and school staff hope to see the homecoming celebration grow bigger and bigger every year. I said, you know, next year we'll have each class to come back and put a truck or a float in the parade so we can make it bigger and better like it used to be. The homecoming celebration was all about celebrating school pride. You should have been a cool girl! That school spirit is shared by both students and alumni of Jackson Central Mary. For 39 News, I'm Alexander Bitterling in Jackson.